Hi guys, welcome to this quick fire tutorial where I'm going to demonstrate to you the easiest way that you can move your camera around your scene to prepare it for rendering. So here I have an example where I have my camera object and I also have a couple of objects in my scene that I wish to render. Now at the moment if I press 0 on my number pad to go into my camera's view I feel as though I want to change my perspective of my render. So if I was to attempt to simply grab my object with the G key and change its position, then go back into my camera view, you can see that the camera is no longer pointing towards my model. So another way of going about this is to lock my camera to my navigation view. I'm just going to hold down control and press C to undo the previous action, which was to move the camera. Next, I'm going to go back into my camera's view and then in the side panel, which you can open up by pressing the N key on your keyboard, go to the view tab and under where it says view lock, you will have the option to lock the camera to view. When you do this, you may notice that a red outline appears on your camera's border. Now, if I was to begin orbiting around my scene, we actually stay within the camera's view. So let's say I wanted to get a top-down view of my object. So I'm going to position it about here, and then I'm going to hold Shift and just move my view so that it is in the center. Now I'm going to turn off lock camera to view and orbit around. You can see that not only has the camera been repositioned, it's also rotated so that it can look at the object that I need it to. I can do this at any point in my project where I can lock it to view, go into my camera's view and just begin repositioning so that I can find the correct angle for my render. Thanks for watching guys. If you're interested in learning more about Blender, then check out the link in the description below. This will take you to the Blender Bootcamp, which is our own library filled with Blender learning resources such as classes, full courses, further tutorials, workshops, and more. Check out the link in the video description and gain access to all of these resources for free for a 30 day trial period.